Hey YouTube, it's OG Samurai 6 here, and um, yesterday when I went to regionals, we did a little booster pack tournament. It was, I believe, $10 to get in, and they gave you five random booster packs, and you made a deck out of that of at least 20 cards, unless you drew a bunch of extra deck cards, then you had to make it like 19 or something. Um, it was from Epic Dawn. If you're wondering what uh, um, booster pack that is, uh, I actually have a deck mat of it. If that helps you remember which one it is. <coughs> but um, it was really fun, and it was a lot more fun than regionals, or that regionals, because... Everybody was either using Elemental Dragons, Prophecy, or Evil Swarm. I saw one person using Atlantean, so it, that was pretty cool. Okay, let's get right down to it. One, Naturia Strawberry. Um, this, like, ever, I saw everybody bringing this out. It was really good. Um, this card's just awesome. <laughs> In a booster back tournament, not a regular tournament. It's sucking one of those. Ape Fighter, Voltic Kong, the Zoo, the Soul Eater, my Beast lineup. Um, they were all pretty sweet. I think I like this guy the best, but this guy's good because whenever it attacks, your opponent has to mill a card, and in a 20 card deck, that can make all the difference. Up, Breaker, the Magical Warrior. Um, I might actually side deck this in my Chaos Monarch deck because you can't really run any traps like a Dust Tornado or something. So I might just run this because it can run stuff over and then pop a back row. It'll make your opponent waste their back row. On it. Blue Thunder T45 won me a game. I'll explain why. Worm Barsis, um, I don't know, it was okay, I guess. Shire Knight, mostly just for defense. This might have actually won me, uh, uh, a game, I can't remember. Charcoal Impachi, defense. Big Jaws, this card sucks. Shark on Yu-Gi-Oh! Zexel makes it look good, but this card sucks. I mean, it attacks and then vanishes itself. It can at least say that it comes back during the standby phase or something. My two flip monsters. Um, um, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Mask of Darkness and Old Vin. Decorative Magician. Um, these both did really good. He got me back one of my band cards, and I used it to go for the win. <laughs> Power Giant, Skull Archfiend of Lightning, and Cyblocker. I remember this one time somebody like potted du potted duality into this monarch. I was like, um, what's the name of that monarch again? He's like. Uh, it's blah, 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 I can't remember its name. So it's like, Cyblocker, and then <laughs> He's like, wow. <clears throat> Creature Swap. Bait Doll. And Offerings to the Doomed. I can't even remember what this card does. I don't even want to mention it. But Creature Swap was really good. I, uh... I can find it. I went Blue Thunder T45, ran over something, got out the token, played Creature Swap, stole one of his cards, and gave him that token. So, yeah. Um, and I only pulled four traps. Ring of Destruction. It's just, there's a reason this card got banned. Spell shield type B, it's okay. 
Pin Pulse, um, super sparkly, it's good. And Blast with Chain. I remember I attacked somebody chain Blast with Chain, and I changed it right back to him. See, a funny thing with Ring of Destruction was I uh, attacked, I had a full field of monsters. I attacked, he played Call of the Haunted, brought back his monarch. I chained Ring of Destruction. I had like 5,000 or something, and he had 2,800. I targeted his monarch card. He got destroyed. We both took 2,400. Then I just attacked for the last 400. For the extra deck, Leviathan Dragon and Wind Up Zen Meister. Um, so it was a pretty fun tournament. The guy I went up against first ended up getting second place, so that was pretty cool. He ended up winning. I just creamed him game one, but it was a pre it was a pretty fun tournament. It was definitely more fun than the retarded regionals I had to go to. That was just stupid. Um, but I spent every single dollar I had that day. I know like 34 of it I spent on tournaments, and only one of them I got past round one, so I don't know if I'm ever going to one of these tournaments ever again, but I might go to one of these again, because that was actually pretty fun, but I don't know if it's worth the two-hour trip. <laughs> um, so, it was fun. Uh, please comment, like, subscribe. Um, Stew Dog 8 was really nice and posted a video of me. I was going up against him on Dueling Network and he posted a video of that. So you should check out his channel in that video. I'll leave a link down below to that video. Uh, that was really awesome of him to do. And uh, make sure to subscribe to him because he shows lots of cool videos. And he is the second person to ever include me in a video, which is really cool. So check out his channel and click that subscribe button. Okay, guys. Bye.